Moti. M O T I. M O T I Moti. D D D. Have you ever heard of Moti? No. What do you think this is? What do you think's in the box? Looks like shoe box. Looks like a shoe box. Do you think it's shoes? No. We could start doing shoe reviews. Can we please? Hey, that would be awesome. Clean team. Hey. Clean team. You got any predictions about what's in this Moti box? Probably a pod system. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Let's open it, son. What's in the box? Oh, two Ryan Hall. It's a note. And uh, yeah, it's a pod system. Pod you are correct. <laughs> and we got a brand new pod system here from Moti. Looks like there's, is there pre-filled pods? It looks like we have refillable and I think we got one pre-filled pod. These are refillable pods? Yes. Okay, and I think that the device comes with one pre-filled pre pod. And they sent a note, it says to Ryan Hall. Why can't they put our name on it? Because we don't matter. We all <laughs> Oh, that's fancy. That's real fancy. Moti, welcome to the clean team. We help smokers around the world break the cycle of cigarettes with the cleanest, most elegant, and most flavorful lifestyle vape system. Whoa! Whoa! It's a lifestyle vape system. Shit! That's what I'm saying. Alright, let's crack these bad boys open. So what this, one, this one is shiny silver. Oh, you've already got one open over here. Yeah. That's shiny. Mm -hmm. That's rainbow. Do you like rainbow stuff? Oh, yes. You got one over here too? That's shiny silver brown. shiny. Dang, these look really good. That one right there, I mean like, that looks fancy. Looks fancy. Looks classy. Well, Kane's popping in a pre-filled pod right here. And uh, that's the tobacco that looks flavor. fancy as hell. It really does. It looks nice. Wacky tobacco. I'm about yeah. to try it right now anyway. This is a tobacco pre-filled pod on the most are you not bad at all? I'm about to pre-fill fill one up though. Alright, here's a closer look at the Moti pod system. The pods up here, the pre-filled ones and the refillable ones hold 1.8 milliliters of juice. Not bad, huh? No. We got a 500 milliamp hour rechargeable <laughs> battery. They're claiming that the pod capacity is 600 to 800 puffs. So if you can get yeah. 1.8 milliliters to last that long, that's pretty good actually. That's that's really good. Okay. It just looks really nice. It feels really nice. I mean, it just feels fancy. Don't you get a fancy vibe from that? Yes, I do. It's, it's very fancy. So what do you do? You filled up your uh, refillable pod? What'd you fill it up with there, bub? Oh, looks like some juicy apple from Glass Basics. What are you filling yours up with, bub? Some One Up Mango Ice, of course. Josh, is yours ready to go already? <laughs> ready to go. What, what did you fill yours up with now? Strawberry gummy. Strawberry gummy, the salt nick. The salt nick. From Nick's. One Up, baby. One Up. Just uh, first impressions, man. What do you think about the way this looks and feels and everything? It's really light. I figured this would be a little heavier. It is really light. It feels like one of them really good pins you can buy. Mine. This is the multi-pod system. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. For for this pod, I thought the draw would be a lot tighter, but it's not. Flavor, it's there, but it's not as strong as it should be, in my opinion. But it's still good. Awesome. What do you give it out of 10? Out of 10, I'm going to give this an 8.7. 8.7, heck yeah. Kane, is yours ready to go? It's ready to go, man. Man, won't you show me? We didn't show how to fill the pods. Man, I'll show you right now, man. Okay. All, All right, right, man. Look at this. Take this pod out like this, man. You see this, man? Yeah, I see the pod there. See the pod? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mouthpiece? Yeah. Comes right off. Oh, okay. see it, man? Uh huh. All right, now this rubber piece right here, this yeah. garment right here. Right, it comes right. off. Come here, you feel it? Two holes inside, man. Hey, those are pretty good size fill. Pretty holes. good size fill holes, man. Has anybody tried the pre-filled pod? I did. I've got it. You're trying it right now. I'm just, I mean, we're we're all gonna take turns here, but like just face value. Do you think people would rather use the pre-filled pods or fill it up with their own juice with this? I really think it's just personal opinion, man. Like me, I like things that I can just refill. A lot of other people don't want to have to go through the hassle of having to refill it. They just want to pop the pod in, puff it, throw it away, and they're good to go. You know what I mean? Alright, Kane, are you ready to vape? I'm ready to vape. Are you ready to vape? We be vaping! The multi-pod system. How she vape, Kane? Vape's pretty good, right? It looks like it she vapes pretty good. She got a good tight, not too tight, uh -huh. not too airy. Okay, you right. know it's it's right in the middle, perfect amount. It's still, in my opinion, a mouth the lung. That's how I would use it. I mean, yeah. some people might use it a direct lung, but personally, how it's drawing, it's mouth the lung. It has really good flavor for what it is. I'm used to like mesh coils and stuff like that. It's not the best flavor I've gotten out of pot system, but definitely you can tell the flavors there. What do you give us out of ten, man? Out of ten yeah. for a good little pot system. Honestly, I'm gonna give it about a seven point nine. Seven point nine. Seven point nine. It's still really good. Right. You know, I've just honestly have tried a lot of stuff like this mm -hmm. and they're all really good so i'm just 7.9 it's a good little vape people will like it i like it and it looks it looks nice that's the number one thing at least to me so far. sophisticated yeah it looks look at the good. silver look yeah. at the silver with the black man sophisticated uh -huh. i like Cade's red one even better do you like the red one i, I love the red one <laughs> once you vape it Cade, tell us all about it all, all righty right. then buddy the moti pod system look there the o lights up on the moti that's pretty cool what do you think about that god it hits like a truck bro it hits hard i i really like this pod system what's your favorite 
favorite thing about it? Probably just the size and the shape of it. I mean, as you know, I really like pod systems. The smaller they are, the better for me. The lighter they are, the better for me. This one's got really good flavor to it as well. I wasn't expecting it to have that good of flavor. What do you give it out of 10, man? Probably like 8.5. 8.5. All right, Megan, it's your turn. What do you think about this mochi pod system? So I use the pre-filled pod. The pre-filled pod reminds you of a mix between a marble light and uh, marble red. It's a tobacco flavor pre-filled yeah. pod, right? Yeah. Overall, this would be a really good hit for somebody that wants to get off cigarettes. This is for the smoker that doesn't want to vape. You know what I mean? They don't want to vape big old clouds. You know what I mean? They don't want none of that. Wow, they don't want cloud. They, thank you, sir. They don't want none of that, man. Uh -huh. They want something sophisticated, mm -hmm. small, nice, lightweight, good to hold in the hand. It's gonna get the job done. Right. Just, what this will be doing exactly. and what it is doing. Uh -huh. It's getting the job done. It's doing a good thing. Somebody's gonna come in here and it's gonna be like, I wanna quit smoking. I'm gonna be like, shit, I got just the thing. Right there. The multi pot. The multi pot system. Look, look here, look down here. You need to kick some ash. You know what I'm saying right now? Yeah. You know what I'm saying. I know what, he knows what I'm saying. I know what you're saying. She know what I'm saying. You know he what I'm saying. saying. But do you know what I'm saying? You need to know. You need to try this. You need to give it to old Mammy up down the street. She wants to quit smoking. She's been smoking 60 years. She can't do it. Get her something like this right here. I swear to God, she's gonna be puffing on this the rest of the damn day. And she's gonna be like, Thank you, Sonny. And you're gonna be like, <laughs> Mammy, I'm telling you right now, if you don't quit that smoking, I'm gonna kick your ass. Shut <laughs> up! What's this? Oh, what's <laughs> no, no, man. All right, I want to try the rainbow one. This, this is the prettiest one. All right, let's get right into it. Here we go. All right, it's my turn. I'm going to be using the multi-pod system with the pre-filled tobacco flavor. I usually, I don't like tobacco flavors. I'm not expecting to love this, but I do want to try it. Because personally, in my opinion, I think that most people are probably going to flock towards the pre-filled pods, especially to begin with, to just test this product out. So let's try out the tobacco pod. Here we go. Ooh. And that is actually a pretty good tobacco flavor. I don't like it, and that's not because it's a bad flavor, it's just because I don't like tobacco flavors. But that actually really does remind me of a cigarette. It reminds you of something like a Marlboro Light or something like that before you light it. It doesn't taste like the burnt version. It's just, you know how that like a pack smells? People who are just coming over from smoking to vaping, they, they're gonna like something like that. So that's what that reminds me of. The hit is really smooth. I like the draw on it. I like the way it feels in the hand. And the pre-filled pods, I mean, as far as I can tell, they hold more liquid than most and the flavor is actually pretty good, especially on this tobacco one. If you are somebody who is looking for an actual realistic tobacco kind of flavor, this is it, this is, this is pretty close. But yeah, we've done a whole lot of uh, pod systems on this channel. This is just another one. This one looks really nice. I, I, I don't know if we got good enough shots of this, but you can tell it's different than any other pod system in the sense that it is a little bit more sophisticated. We are definitely gonna be getting this on the website, and in fact, I think we should definitely get it here in the stores, don't you guys think? I agree. I believe so, right? In the brick and mortar stores. Yes, sir. Um, uh -huh. The more stuff we have like this, the more tools we have like this to convert people from smoking to vaping, the better. If you want to use the refillable pods, make sure you get a bottle of juice. You can use Kane 11, Kate 11, 11 Megan 11, or Josh 11 to save 11% off your e-liquid, and it'll be really good. Guys, if there's anything, that if you don't do anything else today, make sure you slap a like on this video. Make sure you comment down below and let me know what your favorite kind of sodi pop is, and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Always subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and if you want notifications, what else they got to do, Kane? Uh, God, we're... Shh, shh. <laughs> oh, he wasn't prepared. You gotta read that! In this video, we're gonna be talking about the Moti or Mati, not really sure, pod system. And I'm just gonna say it, it's by far one of my favorite pod systems. Welcome back, I'm Sherlock Holmes and on this channel I do reviews like this and other vaping related content so if you're new here consider subscribing and if you end up liking this video please like that smash button it does make a big difference. You know this whole channel was completely demonetized overnight by YouTube so if you want to help keep it going, help sustain this channel and help me put food in my family's mouth I would love if you become a patron but if you'd like to do that or become a member of this channel I'm going to implement some really cool reward tiers and I've got a ton of stuff to give away that I'm going to do over on Patreon. So stay tuned for more information on that. Without further ado, let's get back to the Monty or the Mo I want to keep calling it Monty, but it's the Moti, M-O-T-I. So we'll say the, the Moti. I do have one of these to give away as well. So this isn't necessarily special or unique in any way. Uh, well, I guess that's not true. The design is what's really familiar 
but the pod design is pretty cool. We do have clear plastic there on the pod that will allow us to see what we have left on the juice content. So I do very much like that, being able to see what I have left right there on the pod. Big fan of that. You can see the battery case itself is sleek, really nice metal, feels and looks fantastic. Little bit of a, a sharp edge there on that side, but nothing to make it uncomfortable. USB charging at the bottom. Internally, we have a 500 milliamp hour battery, which for something this size, if you're a pod user, you know, 500 milliamp is pretty good. Most things are around like two to 300 max. So 500, you're really gonna notice that extra, that extra juice as you're using this all day. And I will get all day out of this. I love that it's a simple charge, USB, nothing proprietary, huge points right there. This is a really easy carry, guys. It's just, it feels really nice. It's, it's very carryable and aesthetically it looks great. It comes in a fuck ton of different colors. Well, like maybe six or seven. Uh, let's go through them now. All of them are this metal, except for the Aurora, which is like a, um, a rainbow, but like a really shiny metallic. Probably gonna get fingerprints like crazy on that, but classic black, shiny silver, aurora, deep blue, warm gray, robin egg blue, pearl white, cherry blossom. So they're really like going for the aesthetic, really nice looking flashy almost kind of, of pod system here. And it does feel and look really premium without a premium price tag. We're looking at under $30 for this, and I will have it linked in the description if you wanna check it out. And then something else I love about this is the replacement pods are $14, so about, about 15 bucks online for four of them. And this is an open pod system, which is my favorite type of pod system. So it does not come pre-filled with whatever juice the manufacturer decides to put in it. You get your own juice and put it in here. Now, will normal nicotine juice work in this? Maybe it might not work the best though. So if you're gonna use normal nicotine juice, make sure it's a high PG ratio, like 50-50 if you have it. But I found I like running Nick salts in about 30 in this because of the high PG ratio. I just like the performance much better. Speaking of the capacity, we've got a pretty awesome capacity on this to boot. We got 1.8 milliliters. So more than double what a Juul will have. And it's just really nice to have such great capacity with a great battery capacity. Let's take a look at this pod. You can see it's majority clear here at the bottom, connection pins that will connect. Uh, can you see in there maybe? Yep, nice magnets. Here's how it goes together, only one way. It fits in together like this. Nice magnets there, nice satisfying pull on that, so I'm a big fan of how this stays in. It's not gonna go anywhere. If you really fucking whip it, then it might fly out, but it's a good system. It stays in there well. A uh, little bit of movement on that pod, but not, not nothing to like complain about. Oh, real quick, we do have LED light here, so when you fire or put in a new pod, that LED, well, I guess it's not doing it right now, but that LED will light up as you fire. We have uh, Moti or Mati there on the bottom, and that's the extent of it. Nothing to mess with. Really super simple. Pull to fire, no fire buttons or anything like that. All right, back to the pod. Here's how to fill it. Really, really simple. Pull the black piece off, and we've got this rubber gasket here on top and this lifts out. You can lift one or both of them all the way out. We have two fill holes, which makes filling extremely easy. When you're done, you literally just pop that back in and then slide the cap back on top and it will only go on one way so you don't have to worry about like it not going on correctly. Nice satisfying click there so you know everything's where it's supposed to be. I like that this is top fill. I haven't had any leaking issues. It's a super secure plug system with those fill holes. I'm just a big fan of how that came together. The mouthpiece isn't the, the most comfortable that I've used out of uh, so, some of these pod systems, but it is comfortable and I don't have any complaints about it. So it's not the best, but it's certainly not the worst. The airflow is nice and tight, restricted, great mouth to long hit here, and the performance is by far miles ahead better than the Jewel or other smaller pod systems that I've used. It's uh, in my opinion better than like the Relks or the Relax it's called, or similar uh, styled or shaped pod systems. Just whatever they're doing with this, with the voltage and, and the coil, 
it works really, really well. And then add in that airflow and it's just such a nice, impressive, flavorful mouth to lung draw. Really great vapor production and I cannot say enough about the flavor. It's a breeze to carry. I just really like carrying this. Not many cons at all to speak of with this thing. In fact, there's really nothing for me to complain about at all with it. It just does everything it's supposed to extremely well, all for a really great price. So it will be linked in the description if you want to check it out for yourself. And if you like this video, found it helpful, make sure you like that smash button. Get subscribed and press the bell if you want to be notified when I post new content. Consider supporting the channel if that's something you're into. Help me live. Patreon will be linked in the description if you want to check that out. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Sherlock Holmes and I will see you in the next video. What is going on everyone out there in YouTube land? I'm pretty excited because today's Friday. It is the weekend and I know a lot of you may be thinking, Mark, you don't have a goddamn job. So why does it matter if it's Friday? Every day of the week is probably Friday for you, right? Wrong. Just because I'm unemployed doesn't mean I cannot enjoy the weekend like the rest of you nine to five people out there. So yeah, you could suck it and suck it good. Now today, a product that I know a lot of you have been waiting for. My channel has been building up to this, for this product. Today, folks, it's a pod system. Yeah, I know, I got you excited for nothing, but uh, today's product is a pod system coming from a company called Motivate, and it's called the Moti Pod. Yeah, there you go, Motivate, Moti Pod. I've been kind of pronouncing it Mote. I like the A on the end, but there's no A, it's M-O-T-I. Now this was sent over directly by Moti Vape for the purpose of this review. If you guys are looking to pick one up or check one out, then go on the internet, hop on Google, type in Moti Pod System. It'll come up at quite a few places. You got two different options here. You got the kit that includes the pre-filled pod for $29.95, or if you prefer to use your own liquid, um, you can get the empty pod kit, which runs you about $24.95. And if you want to visit their website, it's modivape.com or on Instagram at instagram.com forward slash vape underscore mote. So let's have a closer look at the Modi pod system, if I'm saying that correctly, from Modi Vape. Now, you got two different options. You can purchase the starter kit with the pre-fill pod or with an empty pod. And also, you can purchase the pods either empty or pre-filled. If you get them pre-filled, they will come with a 5%, which is a 50 milligram uh, Nixol e-liquid. That's a 50-50 VG-PG ratio, and the liquid is actually made in the USA. As far as flavors, I'm not certain what flavors they're going to offer, but you do have two options. So if we look inside the kit, standard presentation box, nothing really too fancy there. If we crack this bad boy open, Let's see what we get inside of here. All right, so we're going to get one pod. This is the empty pod. We're going to get the battery or the device. This is the blue. We'll get a micro USB charging cable. And then on the back side, wow, we have a pretty girthy user manual. This is crazy. Look how thick this thing is for just a pod system. So I'm pretty sure it goes over probably four or five different languages. So the Moti pod system, as you guys can see, it's pretty much a basic, standard, kind of run-of-the-mill pod system available in, I believe, six or eight different color options. It's a very lightweight device. So if you're a hands-free vapor, if you like having the device dangling from your lips, this will be perfect because it's really super lightweight. Measures in at 114 millimeters tall, 19 millimeters wide, and about 11 millimeters thick. So, removing the pod, yours will come either pre-filled with liquid, or if you opt to get the empty one, make sure that you're using a 50-50 VG-PG ratio, and more than likely you're going to be using Nick Salt. Now, these pods hold up to 1.8 mLs of liquid. It's using a 1.2 to 1.5 ohm ceramic honeycomb coil head on the inside. To fill them up is pretty easy. All you're going to do is remove the mouthpiece, give it a squeeze, Pop the mouthpiece off, and you got your silicone plug here. And you really only need to open up one side to fill it, but I recommend removing the whole thing completely so that way when you're filling one side, the air can escape from the other. 
Now the fill ports are kind of small, so if you got a glass dropper bottle, it may get a little messy, but I got a plastic tip bottle here, and I'm just gonna put it right there, and hopefully I don't make a mess. And keep in mind, if you're using a pot for the first time, let it sit for about five or 10 minutes because you want the juice to absorb into the coil. If you don't and you start vaping right away, chances are you're gonna mess up the coil, burn it, and it's gonna be garbage. Pop the plug back on there, take the mouthpiece, drop it in. It's gonna click, lock into place. There we go. Grab your device, drop it in, and you're pretty much ready to go. This one does have auto draw, so as you inhale, it turns on. There's no real way to turn it off because we have no buttons anywhere on this device. So if you're gonna store it, if you're gonna travel, put it in your bag, all you gotta do pretty much, just remove the pod, and that's pretty much gonna turn it off. Now with a full pod, you're gonna get about 650 to 800 puffs, and off a full battery charge, you're gonna get about 600 puffs. So a complete charge will actually probably get you through an entire cartridge, depending of course on how long you vape, how long the pulls are, et cetera, et cetera. We do have a 500 milliamp hour internal battery on this one. It only takes about 50 minutes to charge it when it's completely dead, and you'll charge it by the micro USB port that's located at the very bottom right there. And they do include a very nice micro USB charging cable. You could plug it into your cell phone charger, your computer, doesn't really matter. We got an LED light on the front that's only gonna light up when you're vaping and when it's time to charge it. So as you inhale, this lights up like a white color. And then when the battery starts to drain, you're gonna notice it's gonna start blinking really slow. That means that it's time to charge it. So grab the cable, plug it in. Uh, there's no wattage adjustment on here. There's no temp control. There's none of that. It's a, just a simple run of the mill pod system with a nice anodized finish to it. Got the Modi logo there at the bottom, and that's pretty much it, guys, for the Modi. Let's jump back up and let's have a vape, shall we? So the Mote, or the Moti pod system, I've actually been using the pink one for the week, and I won't tell you guys, I won't get into detail why I was using the pink one. Let's just say it is what it is, all right? Now I got the loaded glazed donut Nick Salt in here, which is too strong for me. I don't do Nick Salt. So I got the Paradigm Nilakilla, which is a regular straight 12 milligram, no fancy Nick Salt or Stem Nick or anything like that. And it's performing beautifully. I'm gonna come straight out and say it because I'm not gonna try to make this thing sound like any more than what it is, which is a basic pod system. But the auto draw is perfect. The airflow is perfect right on the head. Flavor is good for a pod system, and the the temperature is like a cool to a warm vape. So the auto draw is one of the most important things I look for in a pod system because if it's too uncomfortable, if you have to pull too hard, you just don't want to vape it. But on this, a nice comfortable inhale, and it's beautiful. The airflow. It's not too loose like your ex-wife. It's not too tight like your high school girlfriend. It's right on the head. The airflow could not be better. And no complaints. They offer both options with the empty pod or the pre-fill pod. You got your little light on the front that's gonna tell you when it's time to charge it. Your micro USB port on the bottom. Comes in a bunch of cool colors. And I'm telling you, it actually works. Now, it's hard to market. It's hard to sell a pod system nowadays because there's so many on the market and if your pod system doesn't have any cool features or any cool lights on it it's going to be a tough one to sell but if you come across this one on you know on a website or at your local vape shop and you're looking to pick up one or buy one for a smoker or a friend i can tell you now that the mote vape pod system will satisfy all right so that's pretty much it guys that's all i got for you today if you enjoy the video give it a thumbs up if you hated the video and you just hate me in general give it a thumbs down i'll see you guys on the next one make sure you have a good weekend and make sure you guys feel safe and vape on